How do we come up with a formula to find the area of a trapezoid? Well, first of all, we have a trapezoid with a base of 8 centimeters, a base of 10 centimeters, and a height of 6 centimeters. And what I'm going to do is duplicate this trapezoid, exact same size and shape, and I'm going to rotate it 180 degrees, and then I'm going to translate it right next to our original trapezoid. Now you'll notice that these two trapezoids have the exact same area, and I can actually draw a larger shape around them, and this would be called a parallelogram. When we know to find the area of the parallelogram, we multiply base times height. Our height is still 6, but now our base is actually 18 because we're adding 8 centimeters and 10 centimeters. So both bases are 18. So if I multiply 6 times 18, I would get 108. Well, we're going to go ahead and do this with a little more expanded form here. We're going to add the 10 and the 8 to get our bases, some of our bases, which is 18. And then we're going to multiply by the height, which is 6. And again, that gives us an area of 108 for the purple parallelogram. But we don't want the entire purple parallelogram. We only want half of it. We want the red one. So all we have to do is take our formula and divide by 2. So, if I take 108 and divide by 2, I get an area of 54 square centimeters. This one red trapezoid is 54 centimeters. Two of them would be 108, but I only want the one. This is where the formula comes from.